likes the Fury? Oh, who wants to like the Fury? <laughs> um, I aesthetically love the Fury. Uh, I think she needs a lot of work in the way she handles it. Yeah. Uh, it's okay. Um, it looks cool, I guess. I'll, I'll say what, what Steve said, you know, could be great camera ship. And I'll leave it at that. Yeah, that's that doesn't compliment the Fury, does it? That is a I think, it, yeah, it I is. think if they do it right and make it feel really, really awesome, it could still be a great camera ship. So I don't think that's enough of a caveat to save, save it, make it, make it okay right now. Steve, I, I, hear you I, like I don't think the, they're done with it. I hear you like the Fury, right? As like a chase cam or something. Yeah. Like so I guess to talk about why it flies weird, there's a bunch of folks in the in the Discord what you know flew the heck out of it when it was at the what an Invictus to sort of figure out why it flies weird and. The, the way it seems is it's got those cool wings, but it feels like a bowling ball, <laughs> like flying in space, where when you pitch, you don't feel that bite from the wings that you get in most of our ships and most of our racers. It has it has no bite, right? If you thrust forward and you pitch up, most ships, you're, you know, your path will follow your crosshair, right? You know, maybe 20 degrees behind, 10 degrees. The Fury, it's 90. If you thrust forward and pitch up, and you look down, and your TVI will be at your feet. So you're basically, yeah. it, it has no no bite. But what that means is you can't, and so it flies weird. I don't know if it's bugged or, or whatnot, or if they did it intentionally. But it does mean you can pivot in almost any direction when you're moving. So, I mean, in a way, that makes it, it's a bit of a good camera ship in a way because you don't have to worry about the atmospheric resistance pushing you away from what you're panning. Uh, and that also applies to guns too. Like gun work and camera work are actually similar in a way you're trying to lead shots and frame something. So even though it flies super weird, I could see folks enjoying it other than the fact that, you know, a stiff breeze makes it fall apart. It's a TIE fighter. I can see <laughs> folks enjoying it for its ability to fly unlike the other ships. I think it's weird, but it, it does things no other ship really does. I think the whole backwards flying thing, that's for that's for vacuum, dude. It shouldn't be like that in Atmo. It's just weird. I just want, I want it to fly ones. like I would imagine it would fly. And right now, it just, it doesn't. Like the, the fact that, like you said, it's basically like take the center thing, it's a bowling ball, the wings don't matter. And if the wings mattered even just a little bit enough as far as aerodynamics go and made it feel like they actually played a role, I think it would be awesome. There, there's several of us, that, especially those that have head tracking, that that yaw uh, left or right when, when doing a turn in zero G. And when you hit all left alt k and the fury and the wings fold down and so whenever i try to yaw those wings get in my way and i can't see when i'm trying to turn because i'm trying to i'm trying to fly that thing like i'm in app and, and zero g but it just came to my mind if i don't left alt k and the wings are folded up i should be able to see to my left and right i hope i haven't tried it yet but I should be able to see to my left and right so that i can fly like i usually do in zero g um i think if the zero g racers that do fly like that try that i think they'll like the ship a lot more um again you know you guys made great points about it not flying the way it probably should so we just kind of got to make do with what we got for now <laughs> if we choose to fly that thing in ammo do you think yeah, it's something you would time trial with <laughs> That <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll try, but um, maybe maybe in a sh in a place like Gator Valley or Snake Pit, where the where the atmosphere is a lot thinner, it. Um, it's the problem, isn't it, it Steve? Work. That y y thrusters get nerved in Atmo, right? So like when you don't when you get nerfed thrusters and you don't get the the, the atmosphere to lean on you're going yeah. to feel like that bowling ball. So it's like in, in, in space, it might be better, like it might be okay because yeah. it's it's kind of the same as other ships, but then when you you take it down to atmosphere, it it changes because you get the nerf, but not the the yeah. boost from the other thing. So that's why it's kind of weird. Like some folk in chat are saying like, oh, I like that, you know, like you can sort of like rotate in any direction and, and keep drifting. And I get that, but it, it'll surprise you when you try to turn and then you keep drifting and you'll you'll clip terrain and shit like i feel like we we need stronger thrusters and and the way it's set up i wouldn't expect i wouldn't expect it to bite hard like the way it's set up anyways but it just doesn't at all like yeah. that's the thing it really yeah. is 
you go to zero g a ship is a layout of its main thrusters and then all of its mavs and then just the whatever dimensionality of that and then its mass you know come into atmo even if it's a big brick like a caterpillar you still have some aerodynamics of this big surface and everything along with those and it just doesn't have that it's just straight up this ball with stuff around it and some mains and yeah. rock and roll it just, just feels weird yeah it's a good it point it feels like right, a drone and right, right and it feels like it yeah, yeah. well you're you're Steve, you call it the bowling ball. That, that's it, isn't it? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Someone else called it that. I just I stole it. Yeah. <laughs> that's fine. But it, that's so okay. it's weird. It has a little bit of bite left and right, but not up and down. But you think it's still, it's yeah. basically, it's like a little pill capsule. Yeah. So it is actually fun. Metro Loop Challenge. You yaw, you put the wings up, just like you were saying, Shaq. Of course, you have no guns because the guns block that visibility that you need. Yeah. And you just yaw it through Metro Loop. It's actually kind of fun because it does get that bite, that extra little bit of lift and drag when you yaw. Mm -hmm. So it's a fun way to fly it. People are bringing up the the fact that the thrusters should gimbal 360 degrees, right? Or, well, 180, really, if you think about it. Um, that's like, I did a yeah. video for those that are curious. I, I ranted about it a little bit on YouTube. Like, the, the, the thrusters are not strong enough if you consider the, the the gimballing they can do right like they're when they when you're strafing you get 25 percent of your main power it should really be 50. your retros only get 50 percent of your main power it really should be near 100 if not 100 percent and so like it, it's just kind of weird you know it it needs more i think it, they should lean into the the gimballing and and, and just kind of play play with that more don't nerf it and make it feel like every other ship and then also make it not react to Atmo, but I very quickly want to say, like, we know everything's placeholder now, right? Like things are going to change, control services are coming, like, uh, by no means am I saying like, oh, CIG is doing a, doing a bad. We know all of this is placeholder. <laughs>